You have to wonder how many students walked up to these doors with some trepidation over the years, and how many were caught out trying to sneak in a few minutes late in the mornings. This year marks 100 years of secondary education in Felixstowe, and that's why the curators and organisers of the Felixstowe Secondary School Archive held an exhibition and open day on Tuesday, 2nd September, to celebrate the anniversary and invited ex-students and teachers to revisit what was most recently Deben High School, but is now Felixstowe International College. Elizabeth Corker and Ruffy Ruffles remember grammar school days. What was then the Felix O Central Junior School, and we were both at that school. Paul was also a choir boy at St John's Church, where I used to go. Our mothers knew each other, and then we found we were both in the same class at the grammar school or through the grammar school. So we've known each other a long time. My Latin master, who taught me more English grammar than the English master, and called me one day, Ruffles, come here. Yes, sir. Here's one and threepence. Take my bike. Go and get me ten woodbines and be back in ten minutes. And when I saw him in London three weeks ago and consumed a great deal of his red wine, I reminded him of that. These two girls just moved up the road when the school shut. Good memories and a good education. Um, it was one of my favourite out of the three schools I've been to in Phoenix though. Um, yeah, I just really enjoyed the atmosphere, the teachers were good, um, and the food was great. <laughs> Mostly, it has to be just lunch times, hanging out with all my friends, mainly in here, and it was just such a great time. I'm going back to sixth form to study Cambridge Technical Art, Photography, Business and Travel and Tourism, and then I'm hoping to own my own photography business. Two young ladies now, moving on this year to uni. I think I liked most of my teachers. I think I was really lucky with the ones I had. They were all really good and just they were so, they were so passionate mostly about the subject yeah, they taught. I think it made it so much more enjoyable. The English department. Yeah. The whole way through the time we've been here has been one of the like yeah. the most passionate, haven't they? Yeah, haven't they? We also met Diana and Sue, two of the school's unsung backroom heroes. I was here for twenty eight years. I started off as a technician yeah. at Deben. And then when their current bursa left mm -hmm. to go to work for Suffolk County Council, I then took over her job and I stayed as bursa for the rest of my days. And I saw some of the children too, who then had children yeah. and watching yeah. them grow up, which was quite creepy, made me feel really old. I um, was on reception and I did first aid and the database and parents' evening. So yes, initially, and then I went in to do the school fund, which was the um, trip side of the school, which was a separate account. And then eventually that was combined into the main finance and ended up doing finance properly. And finally, we had a word from organiser Jean McPherson. I set up the Felixstowe Secondary Schools archive and we have a Facebook page, find us. Um, and with Bev Boyce, who is the ex-deputy head, we decided that we would do an event because so many people had said, can we come and see Deben? The International College came into the school and we came and saw them fairly soon after they moved and they agreed we would come and we're here. And so the last month, really, we've been making displays and putting things together. And the International College have really been the stars allowing us to be here. How many people have been tonight? How many tickets were? About 200 people, um, give or take. We had a few extra come in the door, um, even though they couldn't, but they were people who we knew about and had been invited. So all told a successful evening? A massively successful evening. We've had happy people, we've had happy ex-head teachers, we've had happy pupils. And some really happy organisers too. A big well done from everyone who attended to them.